Welcome to Bokapod ABC Tanojang, Jungjung Dongsa Pyeon. Today is month six, day nine. Our first word of the day is scoop. Scoop. 한국말로는 국자로 푸다, 삽으로 푸다 또는 국자 삽. 영어로 설명하면 to take up or out with or as if it was a scoop. So, 약간 국자로 푸다, 약간 파는 것, 것이랑 비슷한 느낌이에요. You're taking something out of something else. 막파 먹는 거, you're scooping, if you, if you scoop ice cream, you are scooping it up, 푸는 거고, 먹는 거예요. So you might scoop up coffee beans. You might scoop up popcorn, scoop up sugar or salt. You might buy a scoop, an ice cream scoop, or a scoop for your rice to, to get it out of, the, out of the container. So it means you take up or out with or as if with a scoop. So you can also scoop things up with your hands. Scoop it on this time, shovel, spade, these are kukja, sab, or sab. Shovel and spade are sab. Spoon would be kukja or sukara. And excavate is puneng goeo. Ku paneng goeo. It's taking something out. It's taking something out of something else. So you could say she scooped popcorn out of the container into a bag. She scooped popcorn. She scooped popcorn out of a container into a bag. Hangumalonen. She kunyonen. Popcorn을 통해서 popcorn out of the container 보내 봉지에 담았습니다. Into a bag. 보내, she scooped it out and put it into a bag. The next word is scribble. Scribble. 한국말로는 휙할겨 쓰다, 그리다 또는 낙서를 하다. 영어로 설명하면 to write or draw in a hasty or or el to write or draw in a hasty or illegible manner. Illegible manner. So hasty means 빠르게. 그냥 정신 없이 그냥 쓰는 거고 illegible would be 그냥 읽을 수 없는 만큼 그냥 막 쓰는 거예요. So someone scribbled here. They scribbled these hearts. They scribbled on paper. They made this drawing out of scribbles. Scribble it on bista marin, scrawl, donen doodle. Scrawl is to quickly write. I'm scrawling across this board. Doodle is to quickly draw. I might doodle a face on the board. So you could say, My child has scribbled all over the wall with crayons. My child, Uriega, all over the wall, pyokke untong, all over the wall, naksoder henoasmida. They graffitied it. They put, they just randomly drew all over the wall with crayons. Crayonguru. So, Uriega pyoge ontong naksuru hinoasmida. My child has scribbled all over the wall with crayons. The next word is shine. Shine. Hangumalonin pinnada. Panjagida. Panjagige hada. Yongaru somrangamyun. To reflect light. To reflect light. Ku. 햇빛이나 어떤 빛을 다시 반, 그, 다시 빛나는 거예요. So you can see the, the moon is shining on the water. The sun is shining through the sky. Shining is when that light is going outwards. 빛나는 거예요. Shine이랑 비슷한 말은 glow, sparkle, glitter, and polish. So when you polish something, you're making it smooth so that it shines, so that it reflects. Sparkle and glitter are 반짝 반짝 빛나는 거고, glow is 약간 부드럽게, 막 너무 심하게 빛나는 게 아니라 약간 조금 희미해지는 빛나는 거예요. So you could say the sun is shining and it is a good morning. 태양은 빛나고, the sun is shining, 좋은 아침입니다, and it is a good morning. And it is a good morning. The next word is sort. Sort. 한국말로는 분류하다, 종류. So it means to separate from the others. 단골에서 그 다른 것들랑 다른 것들과 분리하는 거예요. 분류하는 거예요. So you might sort M&Ms. You might sort candy. You might sort different kinds of leather. You might sort books or trash in order to recycle it. 
So, sorterang bista marin, arrange, group, class, and separate. So, group and class are more like tongnyu. Arrange and separate are like punyuada, punlihada. So, you could say she sorted the books into new ones and old ones. She, kunyonen, chegul, oredun chekwa, se chegulo, punyuhayasunida. So, new ones, ku se chek, and old ones, oredun chek. She sorted the books into new ones and old ones. 그녀는 제일 오래된 책과 새 책으로 분유하였습니다.